keeping an eye on your pets has become a whole lot easier thanks to new wearable tech for pets. Joining us now is wearable tech expert Tom Emery. Along with these two crazy people, the, well, dogs, but there are people too, <laughs> Maya, um, she's my younger, shaved golden, and Harley, my senior, shaved golden. Well, I'm glad that we have them <laughs> no, here in the studio today. Either. Wearable tech has gone to the dogs literally in yep. the studio. Uh, Fido is getting connected, and I brought him with me three pet wearables to talk about. Okay. The first one I want to talk about, Maya is actually wearing. Um, it's called Fitbark. It's this cute little bone that is snapped to the side of her a collar that you can see here. I have one here that you can see. And if you're used to a uh, Fitbit or a Jawbone um, or a Nike Fuel Band, uh, you'll be used to Fitbark because okay. Fitbark is Works basically an activity way. tracker for your dog. Okay. So you can see here that I have uh, Harley's uh, profile up on the application. You're hey, able to yeah. see, I know you're excited about all the bark points you got here. So all these bark points are the, the activity that uh, Har, uh, Maya has been uh, accumulating throughout the day. You're also able to see here the amount of time that she has spent resting, playing, yep. being active. This is a great way for a pet owner like yourself to really understand how much exercise she's had throughout the day. We want to look at the other one. So uh, Taylor or somebody, can you bring Harley? Harley, come here, please. Yeah, so Harley's wearing a Harley. smart collar and this smart collar is also for health. Uh, what's great about this smart collar is that it tracks a lot of different vitals. Yep. So you see this purple collar here, the device is at the top, and it tracks temperature, respiratory, heart rate, uh, activity, and you can see here in the application, uh, we don't have Harley's actual data, but you can see that you're able to quickly ascertain whether or not your dog is in a healthy zone for so temperature. So that'll track that as they move. Yes, and you can track it from home because it's on Wi-Fi. Okay. So you're able to actually get alerts if something's going wrong, uh, which means that you can then call your veterinarian and you are provided with a lot of information to help you really speak intelligently about the health of your dog. Okay. And the last device that I brought in is not a health tracker, but it's actually a GPS tracker. So off, outside of health, the other thing that you really want to focus on is where is my pet? Is yeah. he or she getting lost? So this is the Tractive GPS tracker. GPS is something you're familiar with in your smartphone. Yep. You're able to map your dog or cat on a, on a map in an application on your smartphone so you can see them anywhere anytime you can see some of the so screens if, on so you're on not there. even home and you, you're, you're not even there you just you, you can just pop into your smartphone see where Maya or Harley are but you can also set up safe zones which means that if they leave your house then you're, you're, you receive an alert. So you're really kept oh, in a loop. Oh, so if they escape from the if yard or whatever. they escape from the yard or the dog sitter or the vet, wherever you want to set up those safe zones, you can do that with Tractive, which is fantastic. So what do these run in terms of cost? They are in the hundreds of dollars. So okay. Fitbark and uh, Pet Pace, uh, Fitbark's $119.95, Pet Pace is $150. Tractive is $199.95. Yeah. Fitbark is just a one-time fee. Oh, the, app is, the app is free. Uh, but the other two that I'm showing off today have any or monthly subscriptions yeah. to access the data. Okay, yeah. this is fascinating. This is stuff. fascinating. Yeah, it's the next step, though, right? We've been wearing it for a while. And we have been, and you know what? Dogs have actually have implants, so they're arguably one step beyond wow. us. So, you know, wearable should be pretty easy for them. Oh, thank you. <laughs> thank you so much.